girls. Welcome to Preston with Kids. My name is Miss Deanna and I'm so glad to be with you. Have you noticed that the leaves are starting to change colors on the trees and the air is getting a little bit cooler? In fact, I had to wear a jacket today. It's fall and it's the beginning of the most wonderful time of the year. And what a great time to remind ourselves that we should thank God for everything. God loves us and he gives us everything that we need. He gives us our families, he gives us our clothes, he gives us food, he gives us a place to live, and he gives us shoes to cover our toes. God knows what we need and he gives us everything that we need. He loves us so much that he gave us his one and only son, Jesus, to be our forever friend. Isn't that amazing? What a loving God. So let's stand up and let's have some fun singing, praising, and thanking him. so much for showing me that you're ready to learn. In today's lesson, straight from the Bible, we're going to learn about thanking God for our families. We're going to meet a family made up of three people. Their names are Naomi, Ruth, and Boaz. Let's watch. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through. That was so good, Stormy Jane. Oh, you want a treat too? <laughs> okay, here you go. <laughs> oh, hi friends, I'm Carrie and this is my best dog, Stormy Jane. My uncle just gave me a yummy carrot from his garden. It was so good. It was such a special treat. We love treats, don't we, Stormy Jane? <laughs> my uncle loves to take care of us with things from his garden. I'm so thankful for my family, in fact, that reminds me of a story. This is Naomi. Does she look happy or sad to you? Sad, that's right. Naomi was sad because she didn't have any family. Her husband and sons had died and she was all alone. So she decided to go back to the town where she grew up. But look, it's Ruth. Ruth was married to Naomi's son. Ruth said, I'll go with you, Naomi. I'll be your family. <laughs> wow. That's amazing. God gave Naomi family to help her. Thank you, God. Can you say that with me? Thank you, God. So Naomi and Ruth walked together all the way to town where Naomi used to live. When they got there, Naomi and Ruth were hungry. 
they didn't have any money to buy food, so Ruth went to see if she could find something for them to eat. Well, not far from where they lived, a man named Boaz had people working in his fields, gathering all the grain. The fields were like big gardens, and the workers worked very fast. But as they went, they would leave grain on the ground behind them. Ruth saw this and began to pick up the grain from the ground to take it home to Naomi for food. Boaz saw her collecting food. When he found out that she was family, Boaz wanted to help her and make sure she had lots of good food to pick from his garden. Wow, God sent family to help Ruth and Naomi. Thank you, God. Say it with me. Thank you, God. When Ruth went home to Naomi with good food to eat, Naomi was so surprised and so thankful. What do you think Naomi said? That's right, she said, thank you, God. Ruth and Naomi said thank you for the family God gave them to help them. All families look different and all families can take care of each other. Thank you, God, for giving us our families. Oh, hey, Ollie. Ollie, tell me, who can you thank for everything? I can thank God for everything. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can you thank for everything? I can thank God for everything. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you next time. Bye. Wow. Naomi and Ruth loved each other very much. So when Naomi decided to move back to her hometown, Ruth went with her. Naomi was so thankful. And when they got to their new home, Ruth met a man named Boaz. Boaz turned out to be part of Naomi's family, and he wanted to help them. Boys and girls, God gives each of us a family to love and to help. Not all of our families look the same. They're all different. My family has four boys, and they're all really, really tall. In fact, I'm the shortest one of everyone. But... God loves my family, and my family is special, just like your family is special too. God knows us, and he gives us what we need, and it makes him happy when we thank him. So if I ask, who can I thank for everything? You're going to say, I can thank God for everything. Great job. Now let's get our hands ready to pray. Open and shut them, open and shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open and shut them, open and shut them. Fold them just like that. Dear Lord, we love you. We thank you for Jesus, and we thank you for our families. Amen. You guys did a really great job. It was so much fun being here with you. Remember, love God, love people, do your best, and have fun. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.